Thank you, Kitten. I appreciate you. Hey, button pushers. My name is Nick, and welcome to an indie game showcase. I've recently done an indie horror showcase, and obviously, as much as I love horror games, I am really up for playing anything. And same as the issue of horror games, some games just aren't long enough for their own video. So here we are. This is something I'm going to do for, I mean, whatever game I play that isn't long enough for its own video, really. There's, there's not really much more to it. So I'm going to play some games. We're going to have some fun, hopefully. I will, anyway. Hopefully you will. We'll see. Let's do it. In a galaxy far, far away, a solar system collapsed. Destroying all of its planets. Threatening the Earth with its wreckage. But there is still hope. Earth Defense! So this first game is Earth Defense by Matt L. Magda, and as the description just very thoroughly told us, we have to defend the Earth. Let's go. Okay, I'm not expecting there to be a whole lot to this game, but you know, I'm, I'm down for it. Yeah, okay. I hope I can figure out the controls. There we go. Oh, no you don't. Ooh. Off the uh, kind of relatively smooth jet. Oh, what? How is that fair? This is nonsense. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, you're going to get tricksy, aren't you? With your asteroids of stress and doom. Whoa, whoa, whoa! I pressed the wrong button. Whoa, whoa, whoa! There. Woo, hey, speedy. I'm gonna calm myself down a little bit. I don't know if there are any other controls or elements to this game other than just moving, but I'm, I'm assuming possibly not. Not. It'd be good if there was a way to like zoom or move a little bit faster. But it's okay. Whoa, it's not too bad yet. I mean, I've lost. 17% of my health and been hit eight times, but still. I'm still winning. I think. Damn it. Ah, uh, no. That uh, took the hit on that one. That was. Whoa! Took my eyes off the prize. I was off the prize. Yeah, I was getting a hit by a big one or a little one there. I did what needed to be done. And I've just bypassed 69%. That's upsetting. Didn't even get to celebrate. Oh, you're a big boy. Or girl. I'm not here to assume. Get the big one. Oh, whoa. You don't know what the percentage damages are that it does, but... If I have to choose between a big one and a little one, I'm gonna take a little one. It needs to protect my beautiful earth. The fun little, fun little thing about this is when I first loaded up the game, it asked me the region I am. So, see, Europe, because in Europe for now. Oh, Brexit joke. But I think, depending on where you select, it will change, which is quite a cool little feature. I'll, once I've finished this game, I will go and check my theory, but I think that is correct. Ooh. Now, there also doesn't seem to be that much of a difficulty curve here. But I've been doing this three and a half minutes now. I'm still on 50% health. I've just hit 
well, over a hundred asteroids blocked, which you cannot see because more your face is in the way. Sorry. But it doesn't seem to be getting gradually harder. So it seems to go through phases where I'll get a few thrown at me, but it's not gradually increasing. Ooh, oh, okay. I say that and all of a sudden more start coming. So it's getting a tad more frequent. I've angered the solar system. Whoa! I've angered the solar system. Now what I'm hoping for is that when it does get down to zero, the Earth literally explodes or something. If I just get a game over screen, I'm going to be a tad disappointed. Yeah, you know, quarter of my life left. And I've been hit 35 times, but I have blocked 148. So, not bad, not bad. Whoa, that was big. 15, go on. Whoa, okay then. Whoa, that was... That was some substantial damage. Uh, this is it. I'm dead. Didn't even get a game over screen. For shame, Mao made up. For shame. That was Earth Defense. The link to all of these games are going to be in the description, by the way. So if you want to give it a go, see if you can beat my high school, which you couldn't see because my head was in the way. I had 9,999. You can't prove me wrong. This next game is called Swirling Kitten by Hogon 2099 and it was a game made for a game jam but which game jam the weekly game jam week 133 and it is a cat that presumably swells I don't really know many more details than that because I like going into these things blind wherever I can so let's find out shall we all right let's do this okay so I what the f oh okay that's where the swirling part comes into it then i was gonna say i don't think i fully understand okay yep no i don't know what i'm doing ah, i get it 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 oh i'm dead right okay so i have to i have to jump i have to twist and I cannot touch the floor with anything other than my little cat feet. Okay, this is good. Go! Uh, twist! Oh. Oh no, what? I touched it with my feet! It's nonsense. Bowls that right up. Okay, right. Okay, I know I said this a second ago, but I don't want to do it now. Allegedly. Oh. Okay, and down, gotcha, gotcha, Oop. and you can cancel it by pressing space as well, that's good to know, it's stupid, oh wait, am I, what, okay, I'm confused, right. ah, there we go, no, little jump, there we go. Nope, not long enough. There we go. Big kitty cat jump. That oh, crap. What do I do now? Wee. You know what? You know what? I like this. This is cute. It's the sort of thing that actually you think it makes. You think it's going to be really simple, but actually. It really isn't. You, you actually really have to think about what you do, and because otherwise you die. Plus, obviously, cats are a win. Hello, little kitten. Where'd you go? I killed the game. Okay, don't die this time. There we go. I know I said this was a short game, but I was thinking, surely, surely, it's not just going to be two levels. This is so cute. Nope. Sorry, kitty cat. Wee. I really like the like the minimalistic design as well. Oh, that's that's really cool. No. 
gonna die if I do that. So I won't be doing that now, do I? Oh, what? Terrible. Alright, okay. I got this. I got this. I got this. I know what I'm doing. I know what I'm doing. Don't, don't worry. Don't worry. Just stop. Stop worrying. I know what I'm doing. It's all good. That's not it. That's not what I was doing. It's not what I wanted to do. It isn't. That's what I wanted to do. Okay, and then there. Missed my chance. There we go. Mm. I still see your ears, kitty cat. What are you doing down there? Okay, I hope this isn't going to be a thing where I have to quit after every level because, you know, that's going to get pretty tiresome pretty quickly. Okay, here we go. Level four. Mm. I see your games, kitty cat. Now, do me a solid. Don't bloody crash this time. Because I don't wish to keep replaying the same levels over and over again. Although, I am getting really good at the last few levels. The first few levels. I'm blitzing through them pretty quick now. Ooh. Too, too aggressive with my tapping there. Whew. Way didn't crash. Thank you, kitten. I appreciate you. Oh. Didn't need to do that. Could have done that a lot smarter. Oh well. Speedrun! Nothing about this is speedrunish. That was just a bull face lie. Whee! Yes! Complete the game and I only had to restart it about three or four times. Woo! You know, this is cute, isn't it? It's It would make a good mobile game. You'd be just killing some time every now and then. Eh, yeah, it's fine, it's good. Looks good. The kitten's obviously cute, but it's not cute as a cat. Either way, it's cute. Um, yeah, not bad. It's a good little way to pass, pass some time. Definitely fix that bug, though where the cat doesn't progress to the next level because that's annoying as hell um cool yeah kids 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 this next game is the tower by sven lp can't go wrong with the platformer i'm hoping this is amazing let's find out let's, 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 let's do the tutorial first hmm can i use a control i can but I need to move. That's um, fine. Use a keyboard then. Oh, you double jump! What a treat! Jump on enemies to kill them. Okay. Love it. This has got such a cool old school feel to it. I love it. Okay, buy a the shop. Ka-ching! Ka-ching! Yeah! Oh no! I missed the coin! There you go. Boop, boop, boop. No! Yeah. Okay, press one, two, or three. We'll use mouse wheel to select an item. Okay. Um, the items are here. So I might move myself up here. No, I'm going to I'll just move myself down here. I hope I'm not in the way. Ta da! Okay. See so yeah, how that goes. Press the left mouse button to use an item. I don't know what they are. Oh, fireballs! Yes, please. Okay. Oh, that seems straightforward enough. Let's do it. I also have no idea how many levels this game has, whether this is a full game or a demo or what we're working with here, but we'll keep going. Ow, 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 ow! Rude. Let's try that again without the 
swift and horrific death. Ah, uh, yeah, of course. It's a roguelike game. That means it's gonna change. If you, for some reason, didn't know what a roguelike game is. Okay. Ooh. Okay, so the spit things that. Oh, come on. Things that spit fire cannot be killed. That is good to know. Ow. I mean, this is the first layout that I had on the first level. Well, the first time I did it. I think. Hmm, interesting. Alright, what have we got? 20, 30, 50. Okay. I should probably spend more time collecting these. Be a bit more thorough. Ow! You know what? Well, leave me alone! Ah! He's so rude! Oh, come on. Be better. What? <sighs> okay, I'm think. Oh! Can I go down? No. That's unfortunate. Um, stop. So I'm thinking that maybe there aren't levels to this. That was stupid. That was even more stupid. Okay, yes, yeah, so there might not be levels. It might just be try and get as high up the tower as you can. Which, you know, it's cool. I'm alright with that. It's a roguelike game. It's going to change. Which means it doesn't matter if it's that way or not. Oh, what? That? Why? Why would I do that? Why would I do any of what I just did? Oh my god. No, no, no. Thought that was going to kill me. Kind of glad it didn't. Good lord. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not sure about the roguelite element of this game, you know. Oh, come on. There you go. Ooh, this is good. Uh, unlike me, who is terrible. Yeah, it's good because it is changing, but I can't tell if it's changing that much or if there's like a limited pool of levels it cycles through gar leave me alone for the love of Jeebus the little baby Jeebus oh yes killed him in the air no of course I'm not gonna fit through that was why did that happen uh, here, big boy. Ah, a door. Okay. Yeah, I'm not seeing any sort of point system. Ooh. So I've got no like high score to beat or anything like that, which is interesting. Because how am I going to know if I've beaten myself? Hey, hey. Uh, I don't know what you are, so I'm going to buy you. Oh. Yep, now I'm wishing I'd have bought health instead. Okay, door. Nice. Yeah, I really need to buy health. Where to find a shop? There he is. Whoa! I'm panic move, panic move. Don't stop panicking. There we go. Come on, don't die straight away, you idiot. Oh god, I'm gonna. I'm panicking. I'm panicking. There we go. So what does this do? Nothing. 
Ah, okay, I can punch things. Oh, I hit the mouse wheel! I was gonna say to see if I can beat my high school, but I don't know what my high school was. And I can't really remember how many doors I went through. I think I went through two doors. Okay, room number two. That was stupid. Okay, well I'm probably going to leave this here because I feel like that's kind of everything the game has to offer. I'm a little disappointed is that there wasn't a bit more to that. The roguelike, eh, it felt a bit wafty, a bit small, but you know, it's still good. It's still good. I think you implement some sort of level system or even just a point scoring system and you're going to be onto a winner with that because this is the kind of game you can just jump in and out of if you've got something to work towards it gives you that much more incentive because if i knew what score i was aiming to beat i probably would have had another two three rounds on it before calling it a day but eh, what can you do we've still got time so we'll do one more game and um this is called ham slam how could i not play a game called ham slam uh, this is by Damon Rubley, and uh, I think this was done as a project for him to get used to Unity, so it's probably going to be full of bugs and potentially not even complete or playable, but it's called Ham Slam. That's amazing. Okay, escape through the valley from the dwarf farmers. Hi, I'm a dummy. You can left click to screech very loudly. Please don't hurt me. Ooh, that's jolty. Ow! <laughs> oh, wow. Okay. I adore this. It's terrible, but I adore it. No, pygmy farmers. Dwarf farmers. Eat my belch. Eat my belch! John, I'm scared of you. Let's go. <laughs> Amazing. Okay, I don't think I have to fight them. I think I just have to avoid them or get around them. Hmm, a big X. And I want to know what that does. Hopefully it's not the ending. That would be very sad. Oh, it's so jolty. Okay. Not sure what that does. But okay. Let's move on with our lives. Let's go kill some more dwarf farmers. Ah, there'd be another X. F but for why? I'm a pig with questions, people. I'm a pig with questions. This may be the greatest game I've ever played. Oh, that looks like it could be the exit. I could be free! <laughs> oh, it's so good! It's not, it's awful, but I love it! Sweet ham hock freedom! Great work, you win! So proud. Yeah, okay, that was everything I wanted it to be and more. Cool. Yeah. So this has been the first indie showcase, and thank you very much for watching. Uh, there will be more of these coming. If you want to play any of the games that are featured in the video, then the links are all in the description below. If you've got a game that you've developed and you want me to play, or it's just a game you like playing, let me know about it. Leave me a comment, reach out on social media. I'll try and play it. Hit the like button if you've enjoyed these this video, these videos. If you've enjoyed the time spent here today. Subscribe to the channel for more. And until next time, hit the music.